Hey guys, this is number 22, key number 22, and I'm gonna be comparing the golden ray with the silver ray, and just kind of free associating and giving you some of my impressions thus far. So, how do I wanna do this? I think, because I just wanna kind of freely go back and forth from one to the other, and I wanna, when I'm pointing this way, it's gonna mean golden ray impressions. When I'm pointing this way, it's gonna mean silver ray impressions. So, <sighs> I think first, first I just wanna mention that what I, what, what, what I see when I tune into these frequencies, it's basically like, there's like a golden source sun, the source sun, the central sun that most people seem kind of familiar with. And then there is also the silver central sun that seems to be something more people are starting to notice or more people are starting to tune into. And I mean, there are potentially who knows how many more types of source suns, depending on what kind of level or zone of consciousness or the universe you're tuning into. Um, so we don't need to get too specific, but golden central sun and silver central sun. And from the golden central sun or the golden source star comes the yellow ray, the orange ray, the red ray, right? You can associate the golden ray with our lower chakras even. And from the silver sun, we have the violet ray, the indigo ray, and the blue ray. And interestingly, <laughs> how do you, uh, what do you get when you mix yellow and blue? They come together and make green. So in the place where the golden and the silver meet with their rays of yellow and blue, there you have the green ray, the obviously representing the heart meeting in the middle. Um, but it's not really like the golden and the silver central suns are really separate entities or in different places. It's like they always show me that they're like one in the same um, as like a higher unified state of light, <laughs> like unified light, I guess. Um, but they, but in a quantum way, they are also separated or separable or, you know, non, in a nonlinear way, they are also separated into golden and silver. And so you can think of it in terms of different rays of light and the different, all the different themes you get from the different colors and the different chakras you get from the different rays of light. Um, but I think we can also just explore this vibe uh, even further, right? Um, golden ray. Structure, stability. Um, I see like foundational like networks or scaffolding. <sighs> Stability and security. And abundance that you can grow and gather and hold and invest and grow. From the silver ray, the vibe is completely complementary. It is filling in the gaps, filling in the void spaces, flowing into the spaces in between. Complete fluidity of movement and Abundance that flows exactly where it needs to be, exactly when it is needed. It is not held onto, it flows through you and then is released. Everything is flowing in perfect, perfect synchronous timing. And you can kind of feel how there's this beautiful interplay between the golden ray creating these like networks or these scaffolding structures and then the silver ray coming in, flowing in and filling it up and illuminating everything from the inside. Um, so the golden ray being more externalizing, more intellectual. It, it's like the frequencies of intellectualism, academia, science, logic. The silver ray is intuition, 
psychic ability, everything that is unknown, understanding that comes from feeling beyond what you can see, feeling beyond what you can see, even like seeing the unseen, feeling the unsensible, knowing the unknowable. The golden ray. Civilization, civilization. Hierarchies that allow everyone in the hierarchy to benefit from the stability of the structure and from the benevolence of the system. The silver ray, everything being unstructured on a level where the thought of structure almost doesn't even make sense. It's, it's not chaos, but it is decentralization, decentralization, right? If over here it's civilization, then over here it's the wild, the wilderness, right? Dancing under the moonlight. So Golden Ray is partying in the city at like a banquet or a ball. The silver ray is dancing in the moonlight, dancing in a circle around the fire, looking up at the starlight and feeling the primordial magic of the, the night, right? Daylight, nightlight, <laughs> sunlight of our yellow sun, starlight and moonlight. Golden Ray is social commitments, doing good works, acts of charity and philanthropy. Different types of social contracts, contracts between individuals, the silver ray, Frequencies of the same thing are to love something is to set it free. Benevolence and surprises coming from the universal flow itself, trusting that everything comes and, and knowing that everything comes to everyone in perfect, perfect timing. Relationships that flow in and out, in and out spontaneously without commitment. Both sides meeting in the middle, in the heart center, in that green glow, the green ray in the center. Knowing that you can flow into one, flow into the other, choose one, stay in one for as long as you want, for forever if you so cho chose or moving from one to the other or blending them together like paint. You can, you can treat it like paint just as you would blend colors with your paintbrush, blending, blending, blending. You can create new colors and you can create a tapestry or a mosaic or any kind of painting by weaving these threads together, by mixing the paint to create new colors.
the, the, the two rays, the two founding rays, the two central suns that are simultaneously one sun, They're, they're like jars of paint or infinite encyclopedias or vats of oil or just pools of data. You, you can create with one or the other perfectly as you choose, knowing that you, you can just weave, weave, weave it together, paint it together, that it, you can have a preference for one or the other. You can move from one to the other every moment, every year, every life. It's, it's just entirely up to you. They're just different vats of data for you to draw from in whatever mix works for you. And I think I'm going to leave this one there. I love you guys. Bye.